For better or for worse, we're in. One less human to worry about. This mine looks like a tomb. It was closed after accidents were reported. Now I see why. Good for you. Revelio. See any goblins in these webs? Too disgusting for even a spy. <laughs> Definitely think there's something here they want. Incendio. Rebellion. That ledge is awfully high. Any ideas? Wonder spiders give people goosebumps. Could be the hairy legs, or the solar eyes, or the venomous fangs, or any number of endearing qualities, really. Smashing. Should have thought to conjure stairs. Revelio.
and send me. We've read the world of another Rebellion. Fire. I shall sleep better tonight. We're making quick work of them. Professor Hecate would be proud. She would at that. Ramrock's loyalists have all but declared war. Lumos. Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. Rebellion. seen a single rune symbol. I think we're going to be a bit distracted from runes for a moment. An unwelcome distraction at that. We have another fight on our hands. Why am I not surprised? So 
suddenly cleared the I don't know why Gryffindors get credit for bravery. We Slytherins are teeming with it. And we're much more fun to fight with. Bombada! Have a look around in peace. Revelio, a rune symbol above the cavern door. Ranrock's loyalists never knew to look for it. Sebastian, I think I found something. A canvas piece. Brilliant. Our efforts weren't in vain after all. Still, something about this place feels odd. What do you have there? A journal entry by Isadora. Hopefully it will help us unravel more of this mystery. If the triptych led us here to find this bit of canvas, we can probably assume that Isadora Morganark was here. She seems to have been everywhere. But if she was using the Undercroft, and the cellar beneath her manor in Feldcroft, why would she create this space? And why hide it behind cryptic rune symbols? And ancient magic that no one but you could see? Isadora and Percival Rackham, another of the Keepers, could see traces of ancient magic too. Rackham? I haven't heard his name before. Here's are some of the memories I've seen. I don't think he and Isadora saw eye to eye on how this magic should be used. Well, this is all rather baffling. Let's take the canvas back to the triptych. Perhaps the answers are there. This place is odd, to be sure, but I'm fascinated by it. Now, for the trek back out of here and to Hogwarts. Unless we can find another passageway to the Undercroft. Let's have a look around. Moments of truth. It has to fit. Please tell me you recognize the location in this bit of canvas. The good news is I do, in fact. And the bad news? We're in for more trouble. I know that coast. Ranrock has taken over a huge mine in the surrounding area. Mar and Weem has suffered for it. It's as bad as Feldcroft's become. Should we head there now? We should wait. Why? All this time, we've been a step behind Ranrock. I may know someone who could help us get ahead. Who is that? Someone who knows Ranrock personally. They asked me not to mention their name to anyone. A goblin? Tell me I'm wrong. You know goblins cursed my sister to shut her up. Said she should be seen and not heard. I do. But not all goblins Not are... all goblins what? Have you forgotten, Feldcroft? Have you forgotten the mine we just went through? No, Sebastian, I haven't. You're not listening to me. Why would I listen to someone so ignorant? You don't know what you're saying. Take a breath for a moment. Oh, I know precisely what I'm saying. Unbelievable. Promising news about the location of our Hebridean dragon friend and where to return her, you know what. Meet me in the town circle in Hogsmeade.
Revelio. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Just ah. you to You're back. Nice to see you again. What are we looking for today? Thanks for stopping by. Hope to see you again. Dick thinks you should be proud of all the potions you've brewed. Rebellion. 